Hey guys, Big T here. And I haven't been doing too many videos lately. Um, I kind of burnt myself out on uh, having to play that uh, Contest of Champions too much. So I've been taking a break from it. And that's uh, mostly what I've been doing the videos on, has been uh, Contest of Champions. Uh, but I, I thought it was, it's been... My subscribers have been really excellent, so it's, I figured it's been kind of unfair that I haven't been putting out as much content. So I'm going to start doing um, a lot less Contest of Champions, and I'm going to start getting into some other games. Um, I'll still do some Contest of Champions videos, but uh, um, the main reason I played that game was for new content, and and the new content is just very difficult to to get a hold of now so I'm uh, I'm gonna back off on the game maybe put in a, a half hour to an hour here and there and uh, and do I'll do videos once in a while anything covering the new stuff coming out um, I probably won't have uh, access to the new characters because I'm just not willing and not able to put in the time and money um, but whenever I can, I'll I'll uh, I'll actually show off show off the new characters if I give if I get a chance to get a hold of some. But I'm not going to um, go overboard on trying to get on trying to uh, obtain them. <clears throat> now that said, uh, iOS nine is out. Um, a lot of new features, um, some cool stuff. Uh, split screen with your apps, picture in picture, so you can watch video while you're doing other things. Uh, some really neat stuff. The one that I want to focus on on this video is called uh, Replay. It's actually uh, the, for for developers. It's called Replay Kit. It allows game developers to put a record feature right into the app, um, and that. Um, allows access to the microphone and and the video processing uh, features of, of the iPad or iPhone. Now right now there's not a lot of, of games supporting it. Um, if you go into the App Store under iOS 9 it'll show you all of the apps that are, are using some of the new features and there's only six listed that use the the replay kit. I'm sure there must be more out there um, but those are the one those are the games you're going to be able to record right in the app and then upload right away to YouTube uh, and save you a lot of time not having to hook to a computer and mess around um, and if you really want to put an intro in um, you can edit the video with iMovie save it and then upload with YouTube and that's what I'm going to do with this video I'm going to show you how to do it all in one one sweep. Very easy. Um, I've the only thing I had have in here is I did my uh, my intro for my uh, videos. I did a new intro and I put that onto my iPad and and so I can add that in with iMovie. So first thing to do is let's go into Breakneck. It's actually a pretty fun game. I didn't have a lot of choice, uh, but I picked this one. It's a racing game. It's kind of cool. Uh, depending on the game, it, they're going to have the record option somewhere in the settings. This one, they did it nice and easy right on the front screen. The little checkbox, you check it off for record. Now, I won't do a, I won't actually do the recording on this video because I still like the quality of my videos going through my Mac. So I'm recording this video on my Mac. If I re try recording on my iPad while I'm doing that, it'll uh, one of them will crash. It doesn't like doing both at the same time. So we'll, we've I've already done a video. Let's kick out of there. Once you're done doing the video in the game, uh, at least on this game, it gives you the option of uh, sharing the video. That'll kick you over to your photo photo album, and then you can just save the video. As you see, it's in it's in there, and if I go into iMovie, iMovie is very easy. New project, hit movie, 
Uh, you can pick a theme if you want. We're just going to go with just a basic. Uh, if you go into movies. And there's our intro. You hit the little drop arrow. Drops it in. Let's go up to the gameplay footage. Hit drop. Drops it in. You can even create a little transition if you want a fade in effect. Just did a little fade. Or swipe, whatever you want. Put fade. And there you go. That's all there is to it. Hit done. Your video is ready to go. Now I already, uh, when you're ready to, to save it, you just hit the share button and hit save video. I've already done that. Save time. If you look in my photo album, there's the completed project. I also already did the upload to YouTube, but that's really easy with their app. You go into YouTube, my channel, and upload and then you can pick your video and upload it takes a little while for processing so I already did that if you're uh, if you're a subscriber you've probably already seen the video it's up there already There's the finished project nice and easy lickety split so there you have it keep your eye out on your favorite games um, I don't know if uh, if some this game is is fairly it's fairly good graphics so, and it didn't slow down at all so I don't know if that's something that they're going to bake into all of the games but uh, it's a good idea if the developers have that option and it's not gonna it's not gonna take away from the gameplay of their of their of their app I don't know why they wouldn't put it in there. So there you go, let me know what you think of the video. If you want to see uh, a certain game, uh, let me know too. I'm, I'm uh, building a list of games. I'm going to start doing a few different ones. <clears throat> and I'm going to still do the contest champions. Like I say, it's just not going to be as much. So hit the thumbs up if you like the video. Thumbs down if you don't. And we'll see you on the next one.